motion. If you do not know how to do this yet, do exercises. Oh my God, my voice failed. Failed, yeah. Welcome back guys, second part of the thank you for 10,000 subscribers. This will be a short intro because you already looked at the first part. If you haven't, check it somewhere there, look it first and then come back to this one. Again, thank you so much for subscribing and uh, helping us grow. Remember, you can support us also on Patreon uh, by subscribing or core, of course, and by buying our premium materials on our site, Sarchata Dojo. Right now we have like a few of them on musicality and some bachata footwork, but they are really good and you can support us that way also. Also follow us on our social media. Let's go. The first combo in this like second part, we are gonna call uh, these moves like not one, two, three again, like from 26 upward, okay? So move 26 will be this one. Basic step. Pull the girl, push her back, and that's it. Of course, you can go into something else. But for this move to work, the girl needs to know the technique a little bit to have been doing something similar at least. Because you go basic step, you raise the hands while you pull her towards you, you prepare the hands while you pull her towards you but without the steps because you stepped in place, and you push her back while you push her down also. So it's like here, stay, go back, tap. One more time from the other position. Five, six, seven, eight. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Elena will uh, show you like what to do with your head. Just leave it freely, okay? So one, two, three, four, five, six, okay, you see, head back, down, and it's the last one to come up. The second move, combo, but not, it's like a changing place with some footwork steps. So it looks like this, one, two, three, four, five, six, change the hand, one, two, triple step, five, six, triple step, one, two, triple step, five, six, triple step. Okay, of course you can add more on this uh, step. Now, how you lead it? From this grip, you just try to like link the hand with the foot. So you, it's like you're pointing, you're pointing and now you're pushing her like around herself. Five, six, seven, okay? Girls, you might not be able to understand it for from the first time, but after the guy does it once, you will be able to understand it and like do it in sync with him. Don't think like this is like a very leadable move. It's more like a fun and you will be able to copy it really fast. Numero 28. We are gonna do a in and out, but place the hand, lead it out to our uh, head, no, back of our neck. We are gonna Push the girl, go down, do the head roll and exit. One more time. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. My headphones are messing my video. Now, uh, think like this. Do the in and out, lead the arm completely, okay? Lead it until here while you push the girl towards you, okay? Make a little bit of space for her hips. Then push, but do not let go of the hand because otherwise she will go more, okay? You want her to keep close, so don't let go of your hand. Go down and do the head roll, do the tap and exit from the other position. You go a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one. 29, we are gonna change the places and I'm gonna do a head roll. So we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, maybe turn the girl just to finish it up, one more time, one, two, three, four, five, six, delayed turn, head roll, one, two, three, four, change the girl, no, don't change the girl, dance with the same girl, uh, turn her, turn the girl, okay, 30, 
we are gonna, let's say it's not a move, it's not a combo, it's just a principle. Play with her shoulder. So, like you can go semicircle back, semicircle uh, forward, up, down, back, forward, however you want. And of course, you can play with both of them, okay? Semicircles. Uh, it doesn't really make sense to do this with both of them, but what the heck, play however you want, just try to implement some rotational up and down side wave, side wave, side ways, side wave moves for her shoulders. Ladies, you just keep relaxed and try to understand what the guy is doing. Guys, don't squeeze, don't hurt her. Just try to lead it very gently and comfortably. Number 31, it's gonna be like a shoulder back, shoulder forward, back into a wave. A la Daniele Desiree, of course. So one more time, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight as a count. Or you can play like faster, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, play however you want. From the other position, it's gonna be a little, let's do it like this, because it's gonna be weird without seeing it, okay? So, like one, two, three, four, five, six, release and do the wave without uh, going down, okay? Without this, just a simple wave up. This was number 31. Number 32, I'm gonna do it a little bit softer because you know, Elena has back problems, but it's, we call it around the world, it's like you do a circular dip. Okay, but also guys, be careful, do it only with the girls that you know a little bit, you know that they can do it, don't just meet a girl and do this move, don't do that, okay? And of course, practice it with somebody you know first, understand the technique and then maybe try to do it in social once per dance and don't force it, okay? Do it as gently as possible and let the girl have some control over the move how far she goes back, if she holds you, if she uh, pulls back, help her be a gentleman, okay? We are gonna go from a basic step, one, two, three, prepare her, go to the side, back and back again, back to her back and back into the neutral position. So from this position, basic step, prepare, okay, go to the side, back to the other side and come back again, okay? And that's it. Number 33 is gonna be a head roll, but not a, your usual head roll. It will start from the front of her neck, to say so. So from the closer position, you go one, two, three, four. You prepare the head roll. You go five, put your hand um, near her collarbone, like here, and just do not lead it from your left hand. Left hand is just to add like styling to say so, okay? So use your right hand, go with the left and boom, okay? So for my right hand is this motion, boom, okay? Girls, you need to let your head be a little bit heavy and I don't know how to say this, leadable, okay? Be relaxed and follow the guy's motion. If you do not know, how to do this yet, do exercises. Oh my God, my voice failed. failed, yeah. So do the exercises and try to just go with the flow, okay? From one side to another, forward, backwards and whatnot. And guys, when you do this move, one, two, three, prepare, go, then add the hand. And how you add the hand from here, you go to here to be able to make the circle, okay? Don't stay like this because it will be hard. Number 34, from a basic step, we are gonna like, I don't know how to say this, uh, implement a slide to the girl, but she will do it alone. Or in more simple words, you throw the girl a little bit. So it's a, it looks like this. So. A uh, one, two, three, prepare on four instead of the tap and like, and boom. Okay, so on counts, one, two, three, four, and five, six, and get her back. From this position, a uh, one, two, three, 
four and five six okay we are both like on the wrong foot but not actually well, the girl can do a triple step us guys we just step tap and go into the basic step the move is like let's do it without uh, touching it's like one two three four and five and then just pull back number 35 we are gonna not do like two side waves two side openings into a wave and she gave me a great idea so let's do it first without touching so you go one two three four five six seven eight and one so you go one two three four five six seven eight and one two three four from this position and go one two three four five six seven eight again from this position five six seven eight side wave side wave and a simple wave it's like a side wave with an opening instead of doing it like this you do it like that 36 in and out two waves put the girl on your knee and give her a spanking <laughs> No, give her another way to go up. So you go like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, go back. Give her support. Five, six, seven, eight. One more time, more fluid. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, the thing about this move, the in and out, the waves are simple, but a one, two, three, four, you do the wave, five, six, seven, eight. Now, when you go into the second wave to put her on your knee, uh, go one step back, not very, uh, a small step, not a big one. Let her like fall and then give her a knee to step, to step, to, to stay on okay so do like this and then just exit the wave pretzel wave two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight and simple exit three four five six from this position one two three four five six seven eight one two three four use your leg balance exit one two three four guys when you do the wave use your knee boom back and up down and so on so we are gonna do the move one more time like we are in the pretzel but without touching so you can see better the wave it's like one two three four her hip goes back my leg goes back i push with my leg we go forward and go back and that's it. Number 38, it's gonna be a pretzel. We are gonna play with the hand and do a head roll to the girl. So from this position, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, hold her tight, go on top of her hand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and exit to three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Important guys, where when you are in the pretzel, hold her tight, Go here, be gentle, use some, uh, I don't know, martial arts hands. Okay, go up, lead it here, let go, pressure, a little bit of pressure. She will do the head roll and you just then exit. And because I'm a little bit hungry, another pretzel. So you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four isolate like we did in the first part with the hips and chest hip chest chest hip hip chest chest hip and now like a big wave uh, an abrupt wave a not abrupt uh, a syncopated a like fast one like zoom and go back okay so one more time on counts one two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight and exit two three 
Four, when you want to do the knees, not the knees, the, the hips and the chest, let's do it again without touching in the same uh, position, like you, where you, we are in the wave. And now we are going like hip, chest, chest, hip, hip, chest, chest, hip, and boom, and back. And voila, another cool move from Marius and Elena. We are awesome. The next move, we are gonna do it like before, in and out, facing the camera. We are gonna isolate the shoulder, the upper body part for, of the girl. We're gonna isolate left to right, right to left, and then do a circle with it. So, from this position, we are gonna go one, two, three, four. Okay, let's do like a mambo, okay, or a suave. Five, six, seven, eight. Prepare, okay, eight and one. Two, three, stay, five, six, seven, up, and then just let's say another basic exit, the one maybe we did like uh, from the first part in which you turn the girl, boom, pop, or the one we did right now where you push the girl and you just pull her back. We're gonna do this one for this combo. So, one more time, in and out, two, three, Four, do the suave or a mambo. I prefer the suave, like one step on two counts to be able to prepare the girl better, like five, six, seven, eight, a little bit to her side and begin the isolations, like one, two, three, four. And now when I go into the circle, I go down a little bit, like five, six, seven, go up. And let's do the exit. One, two, three, four. I push her, I pull her and one. Now, guys, uh, again, she will face uh, the camera, I will face also the camera, we're gonna do the moves separately. So, like we did the suave, and I prepare your chest, upper body, and to the side, to the side, to the side, and stay. And now, when I push to the right, a little bit down, like boom, and go up. 41, another in and out, with the back, but it's gonna be with a hip roll, so one, two, three, Four, okay, let's do another suave. Five, six, do the basic step. One, two, three, four, do a hip roll. To the side, back, and tap, exit, one, two, and so on. So let's do it from this position. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. When we say to the side, like make the preparation, you see we are on our left. Go a little bit forward to the side, back to the side, and come back into the tap. Let's do it from this position, like a one, two, three, four. A little bit to the side, pam, param, pam. Guys, do a circle. Ladies, do the circle that the guys did. And because we talked a little bit about the hip roll, we are gonna do more hip rolls. Number 42 is gonna be a hammer arc with a horizontal circular hip roll. So, hammer lock to the side, back, and tap. A one, two, and simple exit, five, six, seven, eight. Guys, we're gonna exaggerate it from this position so you know how to lead it. One, two, three, four. Always let the preparation be present and now pull a little bit towards you while you go to the side. Five, six, seven, tap, and simple exit, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Number 43, another hip roll. This one is gonna go like a, it's not actually a hip roll, it's like a hip balance or hip bounce, something like that. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four, go down, go down, go down, and tap, and one, two, three, five, six, seven, eight. So we're gonna do it Again, but without touching uh, this time, so you see that balance going down. So like the hammer lock, one, two, three, four, and I like I breathe in a little bit, I go down and five, six, seven, tap. And then exit. Move number 44, another hip roll, this time a circular a vertical one. So again, from the hammer lock, one, two, three, four. Now, when you breathe, like go up, like 
up to the side, down and push and the simple exit of course, 5, 6, 7, 8. So let's do it one more time. Uh, let's say that uh, we are gonna do the hammer lock. So one, two, three, four and now up to the side and I go. Uh, one more time directly from the hammer lock. Guys, it's important to lead her with your hands but also connect your hands to the body. Don't do this, okay? Do this, okay? So you go five, six, seven, eight, okay? That's important. Move number 45, we're gonna do again a pretzel and we are gonna travel a little bit and do a, a wave on the El Bajo step. If you don't know the El Bajo step, check our footwork bachata playlist and you will learn it. So let's do a pretzel, one, two, three, four, five, six, just travel with the girl, one, two, three, and do the El Bajo, boom, 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 back, and one, two, three. On counts this time again. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, and seven, eight, and exit two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. From this position, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, and seven, eight, and one, two, three, four. Notice that I did something different from this position. I hold her hand. I can do it without the hand. I can hold it like here, like here. However you want, you can do it. It's important to know the El Bajo step and then add it on, uh, add the wave on the El Bajo step. This move, we are gonna name it the unknown move. Okay, it's one and two and three and four. We're gonna step, we're gonna do something with our hands and it's gonna be awesome. So let's go like one, two, three, four, five and six and seven, eight, one and two and three, four, okay? It's just like, even if I named it like one and two and three and four, we are gonna show it on the five and six and seven, eight. We step, push the hand down, then retract, you can add another tap, and do it again, but in a simpler way, like the simple tap. We're gonna do it from this position. One, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, eight. And as a leader, one, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, eight. And you can do it on both ways. It's important to like lead it from your body and use the hand to open up. You see, something like this. Number 47, we are gonna throw the hands, do some side waves on the El Bajo step. El Bajo. Uh, one, two, three, prepare the hand. And five, and seven, eight. Again, one, two, three, four, and five, and seven, eight. Okay, you can do it on the other side, like five, six, seven, eight, and one, and three, four. Okay, from this position, one, two, three, four, five, and seven, eight, and one, two, three, four. Ladies, if your guy is throwing your hand, you can do that even if the guy is doing the basic steps. Something like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's okay. Or guys, vice versa. You can do it without the girl. Number 48. It's gonna be an in and out, but with a different hand entrance, and we are gonna push the girl into a normal wave. So you, from this position, you go up, down and pull her here. Now go and five, six, seven, eight. About the legs, guys, is the same thing, like four and five, six, and so on. One more time. One, two, three, four, and five, six, and seven, eight, and one, two, three, four. From this position, uh, one, two, three, four, and five, six, and seven, eight. Notice how we start like with a side wave. One, two, three, four. Like to the side, we open into the normal wave. Number 49, we're gonna start with our hands crossed. We're gonna do a changing of places. Five, six, change the grip, okay? From this position, like thumbs down, go thumbs up. Now, make a little bit of way, space, not wave. Well, okay, and like, 
try to put your elbows in and then throw them. So it's gonna be like one, two, throw them, touch and do a simple turn from this position. One, two, three, four, five, six, change the grip. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Number 50, special 50, another in and out. You go one, two, three, four, step back, step back, prepare the girl, throw her on one, okay? Push her into a hammerlock while you step in changing of places. Two, three, four, and turn, six, seven, eight. From this position, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Here is the, the timing is most important. After the in and out, step back on five, direct a little bit, open, open to the other side, push, throw, and before she lands, push her on one. You need to push her on one so she has her weight on her right, on one. You also on your left. Twist a little bit the, just a little bit the wrist, and pull her in a hammerlock. Two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. Thank you for watching the second part. Number three, number four, coming up, more moves, and oh my God, like we already have 50 moves, you have material for like 10 years of practice. I'm just kidding, but at least for one year you have. Much love, thank you once again for your support, and see you soon.